today I'm going to be talking more about Lit Carnival and what it means to read local. So if you saw or didn't see my last video, I kind of did an overview of why I thought it was so important to pursue this dream. And I mentioned that whenever I'm able to get this whole Lit Carnival thing up and going, that I want the first theme to be read local. And so the question is, what does it mean to read local? And so I've broken it down into four things that read local means to me. So the first thing is being involved in local libraries. And I know not everybody's into that, but it's really important. Becoming a member of your local library gives you access to so many resources that you don't even realize. I'm not even talking about the books. There's so many things that you can gain from being a part of your local library. But aside from that, it's a great place to get access to books. Not only physical books that you can hold in your hand, but also books that you can download. As a member of my local library, and considering my profession, I work with kids, I go in once a week and I check out books for my kids to look at. But on a more personal level, because I enjoy reading digital books, I use my library subscription to download ebooks. So those are books that I don't have to pay for out of pocket. Sometimes, you know, you want to own a copy of a book and sometimes you don't. And that's where being part of the library is so important. And by being a member of the library and, you know, supporting it, you help keep keep that going. Because there are places that don't have as many library resources as we do here in Hampton Roads. And I just want to keep them for as long as we can. The next thing that I feel is important to the whole read local thing is supporting local bookstores. Now again, I am not gonna, you know, lie to you and pretend like that that's the only place that I get my reading materials from because that's just not true. Like most people in this day and age, I do most of my shopping online. And if we're talking about something other than books, I don't even leave my house to go shopping except for maybe groceries. But with that in mind, I do from time to time go out to local bookstores just to support them because like libraries, many local bookstores are disappearing. So I make a point to set aside money, a little budget for me to, you know, get books from the local bookstore from time to time. And it's just, it's an amazing atmosphere. If you haven't been to a local bookstore in a long time, you should go to one and just check it out. There's so many in the area. I'm even hoping to do a series where I visit a lot of the local libraries. So be looking out for that. The next thing that I think is important about reading local is becoming a part of local groups. Whether that be reading groups like book clubs. I know there's actually some like read aloud groups that are becoming popular right now. Uh, writing groups, you know, anything kind of related to that in your local area and again this is another one where I'm not gonna lie and pretend like I don't use a lot of online groups for that but even with that I find online groups that are sourced um, that are based locally to support that that local um, reading experience and just kind of keep it moving and then the last thing that I think is really important to the theme of read local which is probably going to be the most outrageous for some people out there is discovering local talent, local writers, local illustrators, and supporting those people. Again, this this you know this takes a little bit of effort. I mean, it's easier for me being a self-published author to go out and find other authors to read and support. But an event like Lit Carnival would make it that much easier for other people to find local writers and local artists to support. And so that's why that that's why Read Local is the theme for the first year of the Lit Carnival Book Fair. So there you are, four reasons to read local. I hope you will let them run around in your brain a little bit, think about them, think about Lit Carnival, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye for now.